Welcome back to Bravely Default. And we're gonna go to this castle place where I'm gonna stand here in the woods so I can jerk off. Again, this is another voiceover episode because I fucked up. So sue me. Or don't. Don't. I don't have any money. Shut up. Don't sue me. Save the game? That's a grand idea. Let's go back up to this here castle and see this king feller. Up the steps. Get out of the way, fucker. Alright. This guy didn't fucking do anything. He just sits up here all day. Tis good to see you safely returned. What of Norende? They're all fucking dead. I take it from your grim countenance. Our fears were confirmed. Uh, no gone, shit, dude. There's a fucking highness. crater there. What do you Fear think happened? It will take time, but Norende will recover. So optimistic, well, it's gross. Land. I shall support the effort however I can. He's gonna start a GoFundMe. Take this. It's it dangerous to go as alone. Of your new office as chairman of the restoration effort. He seems super qualified for that too. Yay! He did it. Your Highness, isn't there any way to drive the Eternian military from the borders of your kingdom? Uh, nuclear weapons. Nah. They've been a curse upon us. You know, all Anya, of late. I'm having a conversation. That's rude. And never more than this last week. They're in a lather over this search for the wind vestal. I've no clue what has them so desperate, but they've begun making bald threats. Bald threats? Like they're gonna shave your head? They've birthed their ships at the lake southwest of us with cannons trained on the city. I fear our own ships cannot fly as long as they've our people at gunpoint. Oh, this guy it sucks. He's me, weak. But there's little I can do. I didn't know Jimmy Carter became the king of Caldicia. I offer my humblest apology for the ordeal I have forced upon your kingdom. I am Agnes Oblige, the Vestal of Wind. Turn her over. You. I shall resolve the matter. I give you my word, I will cause you no further grief. You know what? Yes, that would be... Yeah, turn oh, yourself in. Moment. Stop you making people die. Matter, no further, your highness. Farewell. There she goes. Wait, I'm coming too. No, you're not. She's gonna object to his. Uh, party chat. I don't think we're doing party chat after this. Party chat is annoying. Just put it in the cutscene, damn it. You should hold them hostage and make the other people save him using wind magic which he doesn't even know Agnes oh Agnes I have a plan a good one get captured then they'll take you aboard their airship that's your ticket across the sea yeah that's a great idea ships can sail upon the ocean now that it's rotted you can't really mean to. Why not? Anya still kill you. I'll not ask you again. Leave us. You are too eager to meddle in the affairs of others. Yeah, you nosy fuck. Farewell. Fare thee well, tis. Anya, wait. That road leads to the graveyard. It's a dead end. <laughs> she she doesn't know where she's going. Need of a guide. At 
at least let me show you the way there. Unacceptable. <laughs> Stop being so I think dramatic. It's a grand idea. It Anyas. could take weeks with Anya's sense of direction. Airy. Very well. Then I ask you to serve as our guide, only as a guide, and only as far as the lake. Is that clear? Um. As a crystal. Leave it to me. No. Oh, he had to bring up crystals to her. Let's get out of here. Fuck that party chat. We have to go to the lake. Or have a fight with a blue blob and some ugly goblin thing. Kill the blue grimer and Yoda by spamming Brave. Or Tiz will take care of it and that'll be the end of it. I learned Treat. Uh oh. We supplies to last a fortnight. Oh, Fortnite sucks. Iron on Caldisla for a week straight. Sounds like a good dime. Seems we've been saved the effort. Have a look below. Oh, you ruined that guy's fun. The vestals come to us. Yep, that's what happened. myself this time don't try to stop me I don't suppose I have much choice I'll join you yep uh, she's gonna come, come down, down to kick some ass already I'm liable to go on a killing spree if I don't get a proper shower soon watch the ship boys hi sir to battle Why to battle Let's go. Holy shit, did this go to the digital world? This does look like something out of Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Alright, exposition about this before you just kill him. Say we're already finished here. I'm not breaking a sweat if it's not absolutely necessary. Yeah, what? leave her alone. I live for fighting, woman. That doesn't make any show? sense, so. Pick one. Pick I one. You've come to surrender, girl. You've caused more than enough hassle already. Resist, Anyas. Lovely. She speaks sense. <laughs> what? No soul searing combat? No white knuckled fisticuffs? White knuckled fisticuffs. That's the best line ever. Or will it take my boot on your throat? Now, come along, Vestal. I'll see you're well taken care of. I thank you for seeing me here, Tiz. I expect we will not meet again. No, because you'll be dead. Oh, yes! Wait! You can't go just yet! You, Sky Knight, will you promise me she won't be mistreated? <sighs> I've said it once. I plan to take care of her myself. I'll see the beatings aren't fatal. Why are they gonna beat her? She said the beatings won't be fatal, Tiz. She was being nice. But fear not. I'll see she's brought back from the brink each time. Though I fear my magic won't keep the girl's mind intact. See, now she, now you scared her, Holly. I told you before. Not hand you over to these monsters. Oh, 
Um, that guy might be a monster. She's not, really. She's just, I mean, she's kind of a bitch, but whatever. She's just Holly being Holly. I mean, okay, we'll do it. What? Punching? I have no intention of punching. I'm gonna win with stabbing. Alright, you gotta spam the brave. But, not in a boss fight. You take turns. Ha, <laughs> that guy sucks. Attack! Damn, Onyus. That's just... See, you guys aren't good. Whoa, critical hit of two. She's not very good at white maging. Oh, she's dead. Oh, he's so invigorated right now. And he can't hit shit. This guy's the worst. That's why no one wants to be a fucking monk. Just hit him with the stick till he dies. Did you just punch her? Hey, that's messed up, dude. Yeah, you can punch his. No one cares. Oh, he's dead. Anya's beat him to death with a rod. <whistles> Yay! Hey, she learned treat too. Way to be best friends, guys. I have the power. Onyes, we don't need hurt? exposition of what Asterisk do. I was able to stop you. Tis, I was naive. She's in love with you now, Tiz. I, I would involve no others in my journey. The task I Make your move, Tiz. And mine alone. Yet I was afraid. When faced with capture, I wavered. Well, they I were talking about I'd beating steal you. Myself to face any peril, to withstand any pain. But had I faced those two alone, I'd have faltered. I don't know. They suck I pretty bad. Ended in a cell. I am grateful to you, Tiz, and grateful for you. Make your move, Tiz. Join me. Tiz, you suck. I would like you to join me. <laughs> it did that a while back, silly. Silly. It's that no was surprise. interesting. I have it on very good authority. I'm the eager to metal type. Yeah, you're a nosy fuck. We've already been over this. That just leaves the problem of how we're crossing the sea. We need to get you to Anshine, don't we? I have another plan. This one's better still. If riding their ship as a captive out, 
Why not add the captain? Yeah, you captain. Steal an airship? Though, if we did manage it, we why don't they just steal the one that they jumped out of? Let's head back to the city for now. We can ask around there. The, they were just on an airship above you. That's a plot hole. That's plot holes. I'm calling it plot hole. Hold on, we gotta give jobs to people. Onyus, you be a white mage. Now you can set a secondary command. I feel like she needs to know martial arts. It's a great outfit, Onyus. He's still wearing a puffy shirt from Seinfeld, and I'm not making him a monk, because monks suck. But I will give him a secondary command. Now we gotta go back to the dumb town. And you have to walk through the front. You can't walk into the side. That's madness. You, sir! You chased off the Eternian ship? Yeah, kick their ass. Amazing! Truly, the Vestal is a worker of miracles. And you as well, Tiz. I feel like Tiz did most of the work. Has there been any word of where the ship has gone, Your Highness? What have you heard from your man, Owen? It seems the Sky Knights have returned to their hold, Your Majesty. The Lantano Villa. Ooh. That sounds fancy. Then that's where we're headed. I'm afraid you'll not get there now. The bridge they shot out is still in ruins. We'll mount a full-scale offensive the moment it's repaired. For now, we must be patient. Patience Go is for rest. stupid people who fucked up. Tiz, Tiz, wake up! Wake up, Tiz! <sighs> What's wrong? It's the middle of the night. Well, clearly you can hear fire in the background. Outside? Yeah. Wait, is that? Oh shit. Give us a best We know she's here. Oh good, he stutters. That'll be fun. And you best be quick. A fire spreads so easily. <laughs> Seems like this guy likes Sir, fire. Is this really necessary? What? No. Uh, yes, I won't be questioned. Yeah. You're under my command now. You'll follow my orders. Yeah, Adia. Spoilers. <laughs> burn! Burn! We can. It's a bunch of nonsense. Looking for me. If I go, they'll stop this madness. You can't be serious, miss. You'd be marching to your own death. Yeah, he'll set you on fire. I'm pretty sure that ominous guy doesn't give any fucks. That seems fair and reasonable. Oh, she used this full name. Place. 
<laughs> she said it. Uh huh. What a pansy. All she said was five and then four. She is a bully. And that's why we like her. And that was sexist, ominous. I think this guy's got a problem. He's like a pyromaniac. You could apologize to those people. Thankfully, our only casualty was a house. An old one at that. Well, shoot. Officers. He's holed up in the ruins of Central Keep. North of the city. The hostilities will end once I step forward. There you go again, ready to martyr yourself. There are two of us now. That broadens our options. Might I interject? Yes, you can always interject. Ah, it's Mr. Amnesia. You were staying in the empty house that burned, weren't you? Mr. Amnesia. Is that foreign? Ha! <laughs> Zing! I mean, the boy has no memories. He just turned up in town a week ago. No clue who he was. I see you've suffered some light burns. Are you sure you should be up and walking about? Look, I'm fine. He's. I thank you for your gracious. He could take being burned. More to the point. You two are Tiz and Agnes. Yes. Uh, but why? I don't recall giving you my name, sir. You'll have to. Motherfucking ring a bell. The only thing I had on me when I was found, apparently. <sighs> He's from the frickin' future. He's like a terminator. Like word of your aims to plug up that great sinkhole. What? What's more? And this far is key. The journal states that you too will encounter a certain female. If my suspicions are correct, it's the girl who was accompanying that Eternian Firestarter. Pardon my asking, but how do you tie in? It appears you make for the central ruins, no? Then bring me along. That girl tugs at my mind, oh, we've met before. When I saw her face amid the flames, I felt a spark. Not your customary running for your life What a thrill, poet. Mind, but a real Thundaga to the heart of Ithany. Her gaze was equal parts innocence and tempered steel. Oh, to see those eyes don the sparkle of a He's smile. making everyone swoon. Her voice, gentle as spring sweet breeze. You could look at Owen back there and he's like, oh my god. Ah, oh, my heart races. I insist you let me join you. It simply must be so. Unacceptable. Also, I'm I guess Anyas wasn't wasn't uh, swooned at all. But why? This is an upstanding gentleman's heartfelt plea. <laughs> upstanding gentleman. Okay. I cannot trust a man such as yourself. My answer is no, sir. Still, he's some kind of vagabond. More better than two. His personality leads the fit to be desired, but I'll vouch for the man's skill. What? He His personality is boy. awesome. Oh boy, a wild boar, though. That'll really help. Not pose a problem, lovely. It was you lovely. Remember your name? They call me Ringabel. It's a pleasure. My Lady Vestal, from this day hence, I shall be your sword. Whoa. No, thank you. I hope this was a good idea. Tiz, why aren't you sure? Alright, so we're gonna go to Centro Keep and we'll come back next time and do that. That'll be fun. Hey, thanks for watching. Be sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel, Follow me on Twitter.